Hey there, 3D printing enthusiasts. Ever been bugged by those stringy, oozing messes on your prints? Well, today's your lucky day, cause we're deep diving into that. Okay, quick crash course, stringing or oozing happens when, mid-print, your nozzle decides to move and leaves behind these annoying filament strands. Yep, we also call them those dreaded, hairy prints. Wondering why this happens? Two big reasons. Your filament temperature's off the mark. Too hot. It's gonna flow like molten lava. Those tricky retraction settings. If they're off, expect a filament trail. Now, onto some real-world testing. I stumbled upon these retraction towers on the Teaching Tech YouTube channel's companion website. Did a quick test and, spoiler alert. 0.8 millimeters looks solid. I also played around with different slicers, Kura, Simplify 3D, and Idea Maker. And boy, the printing paths? So different. It's like choosing between rock, paper, and scissors. Next up, I swapped out the printer nozzle. Good news? Less stringy. Bad news? Still got some oozing. Ever printed a temperature tower? I did, aiming to nail the perfect temp. Using PLA, I went from 180 to 220 degrees Celsius, in 10 degree steps. Looks like 190 degrees Celsius is the sweet spot for me. I even switched up the filament and printed again. And holy smokes, the results were off the charts. Couldn't help but reprint the Luby underscore Adelinda underscore dragon. It turned out amazing. So, recap time. To tackle stringing and oozing, I tested different slicers, tweaked retraction settings, changed nozzles, and even switched up the filament. Best moves? New nozzle and dry filament. If you're just starting out or feel like your prints have lost their mojo, maybe it's time to adjust that temperature and retraction. Or just swap out that old nozzle and grab some dry filament. That's a wrap, folks. If this was helpful, smash that like button. Got some printing tales of your own? Drop M in the comments. And if you're not subscribed yet, Hit that button and join the crew.